Students around Missoula were very busy today. They were loading backpacks for the first day of school. But the students at Lowell School saw some big changes. Montana McLaughlin checked in with how Lowell School students are holding up at their new location as the school undergoes renovations. <laughs> Excitement filled the air Monday morning as students put on their best for a fresh start to the school year. I'm wearing uh, the striped dress and this shorts and I got these sandals that look pretty. Light up over there. First, it was off to the bus stop. Something new this year for several low school kids. I'm a little bit nervous and it's going to be really weird, I think. Riding the bus is going to be a different experience for him. We're up earlier. <laughs> It takes a little, a little more time to get her off to school, but we're still close enough to the bus stop. I think once she's got it down, she can walk on her own. The first day of school looked a little different for nearly 300 kids who are now calling Mount Jumbo School in East Missoula home for the year. But those changes did not stop the excitement. I'm excited. I'm really, really excited. I got my backpack in the car because guess what? I am ready for school. Morgan Burke started kindergarten this year and isn't afraid of the bus ride. But for Scott and Randy Amon's son, Xander, now in fourth grade, it means a longer school day. I think he'll get home closer to four o'clock than, than usual, so that'll kind of throw some wrench into the thing, but we'll make it work. And most say they're looking forward to the long-term upgrades at Lowell. I think it's cool. I think it's definitely needed, you know. I wish that it could be completed faster, but it'll be awesome once it's finished. She's already excited seeing it torn down. <laughs> Kids are resilient. Tomorrow is going to be a new day. Despite the change, it was smiles and laughs as parents hugged goodbye. Kids greeted their friends and rang in the new school year. That was Montana McLaughlin reporting with the news.